An EIA program is made up of lines of commands called blocks. A finished program can contain anywhere from just a few blocks to hundreds of blocks, depending on the complexity of the machining required. The blocks are normally executed by the computer in sequence. In this part program, each block starts with a sequence number. The address N designates that the number that follows is the sequence number. The primary purpose of sequence numbers is to serve as an indexing system. They allow the programmer and operator to quickly locate blocks, either visually or using the search functions built into the control. The computer normally does not need sequence numbers to run the program properly. In fact, some part programs are written without sequence numbers. Other programmers prefer to use sequence numbers to mark sections of the program. This program has a sequence number at every tool change command. In Okuma programs, in addressed words are called sequence names. This is because letters as well as numbers can be used with the in address. Each block in an EIA part program is made up of coordinates, programming codes, or often both. An EIA programming code consists of an address letter followed by a number with one, two, or more digits. The most common EIA codes are G codes and M codes. G codes are called preparatory codes. They prepare the machine to perform a particular operation. For example, G01 is the code for linear interpolation. The word interpolate means the computer has to calculate the points the tool must pass through in order to reach the endpoint. Linear means it will move the tool in a straight line. The line may be at an angle, but the tool movement will be a straight line from the start point to the end point. 